I'm Smithy, this is a Contiki, and I've, believe it or not, just cooked all of my tea in one pan. One pan. How good is that? Stay tuned. Oh, it's freezing. Got some candles lit. I just thought I'd show you how cosy it is. <coughs> I've been on this site, we're in the Lake District at the minute, <coughs> guarding a site. Let's put the light on. I could just put the van's big light on, but uh, I might as well make use of what I've got. I just wanted to show you how cosy it is without the light on. Didn't we? So Benji's guarding with me. A couple of energy drinks. We can cook some food because we've got gas. And uh, we're going to make a coffee in a minute. Uh, if you're an old silver fox like me, you'll know I'm Smithy, this is a Contiki, that's Benji and we're a security guard for the night again and uh, guarding the site of the Lake District and if you're quite new to my channel, I just have fun, make videos about nonsense and uh, yeah, that's it really, don't we, make nonsense videos, eh? So yeah, we just have a laugh uh, when I get the chance to go metal detecting, I'm dying to go gold panning and uh, you know there's all sorts of what I do but anyway we've uh, we've got the van, we're out and about, we're earning a few quid in it and we're here till 7 in the morning so we've got to pass on till 7 in the morning so he walks around with me all night long the last worker's just left, well about 20 minutes ago so I'll write the time down and then uh, I've locked the main gate, that's us for the night so we're going to have a coffee aren't we, let's go and have a coffee. I'll bring you back in a minute, we'll have a coffee. Paul, I tell you, I can see. Right, we are having Roastery Plantation Wharf Grand Cafe. Right, so let's have that. I haven't put any water in this, have I? Put a nice, uh, nice dollop in. So anyway, I hope you're all keeping well. <coughs> I've had a flu jab, so I'm waiting for this other booster thing as well. Oh, don't tell me I can't get it out now. I should have put the water in first. Come on. Why does it have to be awkward like that? Right. There we go. There we go. Right, you top it up just to the below the level of the. Uh, it has a thing there, you know, a valve release thing. So you fill it just below that. So let's make sure we've got some gas. Oh yes. Oh. In fact, we we'll use the other one. Light it. I always turn the gas off when uh, when I'm not using it. The gas is off. Oh, it's a while since I've had a real coffee like this. Anyway, that's sorting. Trevor's cup. Did I put, I put sugar in? I don't want to smash in it, do I? Coffee mate. Two coffee mate. What we're going to do, we we'll cook some food after. And we've got two cod slices. You know, cod in butter sauce. It's still quite frozen really. Um, I'm going to have smash with it and it's in a garden piece because Sue doesn't like garden <coughs> garden piece so I always have to have uh, process piece. Anyway and Benji's got some Caesar for when I have my food so we'll all be having something to eat. 
Now then, I'll tell you one thing. Let's put light on. Why is that that one? Oh, come on. Our bulb's going. I think that bulb's going. Anyway, I'm going to sort this out because last time I was here I was freezing. And I think I was freezing because of all this cab being open. So what I'm going to do, I've got this. So let's close that up. Alright. And then we're going to put this under this mattress. How cause is that? I'm hoping you can see that. Let's uh, I'll take you nearer. There look. So now there's nothing coming through. Does this light work? Why is that light not around? Yeah that light's on. Let's turn this one off. That was that, uh, that light of all. Oh, how's that? Let's turn you around a little bit. Yeah, so we're, we're cooking with gas now. Brew's on, and uh, we'll have a coffee. And we're guarding a site for tonight. Great, we're being paid again. In the Lake District, that Benji. So what I'm going to do, I've got some uh, roast potatoes, not roast potatoes, uh, potatoes that you can go in the oven that have already got uh, cheese and all that on from Asda, I've got four of them, so I'm going to put them in the oven in a minute and I'll just leave them cooking till they've cooked, then turn them off and leave them and I can have them at any time during the night and uh, what time are we on? Nearly half six, I probably have tea about eight o'clock so I'll have my fishing butter sauce Fishing butter sauce, uh, what else are we going to have? Fishing butter sauce, mashed potato. We've also got, oh yeah, we've brought some of these little tubs, only a pound that has the these tubs, and you can wash them out. So we've got real butter in there to mash in the mash, and that is sea salt. So we're going to try it with sea salt in this mash. The fish won't need any, any additives because you already have it in. So the next job is TV. Now I have shown you this before. Uh, I do know the TV antenna. He wants to be facing that way, doesn't it? But we do have an app. I've told you before. I've got an app for it. I hope you can see that. It went off last time when I did it. Oh. I don't want to buy the Edit Pro. There, look. So you can see all the. Well, it's gone off again. So it tells you arrows of where the nearest one is. So let's tune the TV in and get the area up. I don't know if you can see this, but I'll try and show you the aerial. There's the aerial. You undo that. Now I know in a straight line there. So the aerial's facing that way at the minute. So if I do it half a turn. That way. So the wire there. He's now facing that way instead of this way. I know that's half a turn. And it should be facing that way. So let's plug it in. Hey, you don't mind me taking you on this journey with me. I don't know why I've taken my glasses off because I'll need them on again, won't I? So we either get a signal from last time or we don't, right, we don't. So I'm finding I'm having to tune this telly in every time I... Uh, Unplug it. Auto tuning, UK. Let's see what we find. So it searches through the analog first and then the digital after. And then we'll check the coffee in a minute. And hopefully we'll have TV. Are you going to sleep, Benji? You're supposed to be securing this site with me. I've got a little light there. It's a little camera, you know. 
you can have it on your tripod with uh, a go. Now then, I hope that light's all right for you. Just going to uh, get a cloth. Close the microwave. Right. I'm going to have to wet the cloth. Right, so what we're going to do is some cooking. Right. But we're going to do it a little bit different. So what I'm going to do, I'm going to attempt to cook my cod steaks, my smash with the butter that I've got and the peas. Right. So that's our dinner, that's what we're going to eat for tea. But I'm going to try it in one pan. That's what we're going to do. So we're going to do it all in one pan. Now these take, I've had these before, they take 20 minutes. Let's put a bag in there. rubbish in there thing. So, is it going to lie? Yes. Right, so when that boils, you simmer it and it takes 20 minutes. So I need a sharp knife to cut the bag, plate, fork and then tin opener. Have I got a tin opener? I'll have a tin opener somewhere. Right. It's good when these tin openers go because they fall to bits, don't they? Should we put another light on? There we are. Right. That's ready. Plate. So we'll let that boil and uh, we're going to do everything in one pan. I'll just show you something. We're not actually shorter pans, as you can probably see. We do have a few different pans or a selection of pans. So what the idea is, can I just cook it in one pan? I just got the thought before and I thought let's just have tea but why not do it a bit of fun? We'll have it in one pan. So not because we haven't got any pan. I would have cooked this outdoors on that, you know, out there but it's absolutely freezing. Hence why I put the quilt there. <coughs> um, it just divides the van off because that is the coldest area of the van, apart from the back, because the back does have three windows, but they are double glazed. Then windows at the front are single glazed. And uh, the glass, so they just transfer the cold in. But doing that, it's actually, if you put your hand in there, it's cold in there. Now I've got this little heater on here. So, all the food in one pan. Uh, with fresh water. So that water that's in there is the water I'm going to use to make the mash. Uh, I'm going to need a bowl for that, aren't I? A bit of candle wax on the bottom of my bowl. So there's the bowl. Right. So we'll do the mash in that with the boiling water in fact I think we'll have a bit more water and then we can have some more mash so what's going to happen then is we're going to get the fish out open the fish in the plate at the same time as mixing the, the smash in there while the peas are heating up and peas what do they take two minutes three minutes and they're ready so the whole food when, they, when that's ready the whole setup is going to take three minutes and we've got tea beautiful all in one pan one pan how good's that so how much washing up is there one pan and a bowl and a plate 
rather than three pounds. That's the idea. A bit of fun. Told you. Why not have fun in life? So we're cooking tea in one pan. I'll bring you back when that's boiling and when we're nearly done. I had to turn the telly down because I've got Star Trek on. Anyway, it's boiling, look. You see it boiling? Where's the thing at? Right, so we're going to measure 20 minutes from now in time. So, we are on 10 past. So, half past. Half seven, it's ready. Who's that? Van. Let's get the torch. I like to just shine it about. Then they know there's somebody on site then. It's, there is a little industrial unit just up there, so I think that's where they're going to, but at least they can see me van all lit up. Right, so half past, and that's ready. So, we want some smash, but I put the hot water in first. Give me a fork. So that hot water is going in there. Then we'll put the smash in, then we'll put the butter in, and then we'll put the uh, sea salt. I'm actually red hot now with that cover on there. I might take all this off. Bear with me. Right, that's better. I was red hot. Right, I'm going to light the oven, Benji, if you don't mind. Which is the oven? That one. I've actually opened this window because when I'm cooking I like to ventilate the place. Just I've always been like that. Right, so what we're gonna do we've got some stuffed jacket potatoes, so we're gonna cook all four, and when they're cooked I can just take two out, warm two up at a time, and that's my food for the night during the night. Falling to bits. Now yeah, look, have I not got any? Uh... It's some foil, don't I? Another tin opener just in case. What's this? Vehicle foil, that'll do. This is just that paper you can cook on. Well, it does any dirt will go on that and not in the oven. Oops. Right. Take that out of it. This is the thing. You can go in the bin, spread these out. There you are. So we cook them. Make sure that <coughs> the paper don't catch fire. Right, that's them. So that's got to half past, haven't it? So it's only it's only 13 minutes past. I'll turn it down, is it? Turned it off. Why can you not get it to a nice look right there? Right. So let's leave that simmering away. Make sure it doesn't run out of hot water. Uh, Benji, 
Let's give you some food, eh? Benji's having some Caesar, so I'll give him half now and half later. And then he's done. Yeah, it's yours. Right, that's yours. So you can have half now and half later on. I'll leave the knife in there and I can chuck the knife in the finger away at the same time. Right. Eagerly waiting the food. So, I'll finish watching a bit of Star Trek and uh, we've got 15 minutes till that's ready now. It's still bubbling too much. Let's move it up a bit. That's getting quite hot, that handle. Nice aluminium cooking pan, that. So, uh, yeah, more versatile pan. We're cooking the whole of the tea in one pan. See, this is what I used to like it, man, mucking about, and I haven't been able to for a while, and now I can. So, and I get paid for it as well. How good's that? Making your tea and you're earning, you know, whatever I get an hour. But I'm not telling you. But yeah, hey, I can't beat it at all. What can I say? Why, why have you took it out of the bowl to eat it on the floor? What is the point in that? That's what the bowl's for. He's took the food out of the to eat it on the floor. I don't know. Oh well. Right, so I'll do that. I'll watch a bit of Star Trek and bring you back. Right, good to have you back. So we're cooking tea in one pan, so they're ready. So what I need to do now, we keep that over there, don't get hot. Right, we need to take these out. There was a cloth to do it with. Lovely this fish in the bag, beautiful. Try and get all the water out. Well, not out off it. Absolutely red hot. Right. So they're there. So what I want to do now is put this water in here. Maybe not all of it. That'll do. We can pour fresh water down the sink. While that's doing that, peas on. Oh, I do love garden peas, right. In fact, I'll leave that up here because I don't want Benji touching that. So the peas are on. Turn them up a bit. Right, mash. So first thing is butter. Knob of butter. Let's get that melted. Will that be enough? You better not play up with my gold bladder. So I can wash these out, you see, use them again. That's why I bought them. You get about eight for a pound at Asda. Uh, yeah, go on then, we'll put the salt in now and it'll, that'll start to dissolve, won't it? You do need quite a bit of salt with this uh, smash. Right. Let's get some smash in. The trick is just getting the right amount in it. Because I don't have any more hot water to put in. Should have saved the hot water till I'd made it really. Anyway, not to worry. I've had plenty of smash in the past. Right, I'm just going to leave that to soak up the water. 
and I might need a bit more what's it in there put you there rubbish bag because this is going to have uh, juices all over it, isn't it right I've got my knife punch sharpening. I have a knife sharpener as well. Beautiful. Right. One more. Put that on that cloth. So, we've underestimated the amount of uh, butter sauce there, haven't we? But not to worry, all the rubbish in the bin, including you. And now I've got juice all over my hands. Where's the cloth? Right. So our peas are boiling nicely. Are they full or not? Yeah. Right, so I'll mash. That's just right like that. That'll do. Put the mash in here. Nearly done. Tea cooked in one pan. Right, we're going to spill that, aren't we? That needs washing. Tell you what, I could do with you. Then. Let's get some of this mm. butter sauce. In fact, we'll put a bit over the potato. It's good because you can dip the, the mash in the butter sauce as you eat it. Right, peas now. Well, I've got a bigger thing for peas. Hey! I don't mess about. Right, so they're boiling now, that's it. Job done. Job done. So we've got the oven on. The oven is nice to bake in the potatoes for later on. Let's see if we can fit some of these peas in here garden peas I can't have these when I'm with Sue because she don't like them she only likes processed peas well look at that for a tea how good's that I've knocked it up in half an hour and it was only half an hour because of the well 20 minutes or whatever because of the fish taking its time boiling the bag get plenty of these peas in right there you go There's my tea, all cooked in one pan. How good's that? So there you go, if you want a challenge, you want something to do, cook your tea in one pan. See what you can come up with. Right, see you shortly. I'm gonna eat that. <laughs> ben is asleep watching me. <coughs> there you go, I'm Smithy. I've just eaten all my tea that was cooked in one pan. And hey, beautiful. Try that, one pan, one pan challenge. Cook your tea. Just don't come up with a five course dinner because I'll be sick. I only did a three, three well not a three course dinner, I did a, th a three item dinner. Anyway, beautiful. So I hope you enjoyed the video. It's all fun isn't it? What else can you do in life? Apart from get wind now. Oh. Right, I'll get rid of my wind. I'll go and wash up and uh, I'll see you again. That was nice that. Out of the simplest foods, just, do you know what I mean? Anyway, take care, stay safe, be lucky, and Smithy, Conticky and Benji, and whoever else, Susie or George or whoever's in the van, I'll see you shortly. See you soon.